as we continue, we now have placement of our final placement of our two pressure washers. There's a four gallon a minute machine and then an eight gallon a minute machine. And what we basically did is you notice that the machines have a rubber foot on them and a bolt through there. We removed the bolt, purchased a longer bolt, and then put them in the final placement and then went ahead and drilled them through and secured them through the wood on the trailer. The uh, four gallon a minute is placed towards the front, a little bit lighter weight. We made sure we had access to clear the water input and the water output on the pump. We also have access for any reservoirs that need to be filled or checked on a regular basis. We took the pull handle and rotated it from its stock position so we could access it from the front of the trailer. As you can see, it's got a little rotation. We also have clearance that if we need to get in there to the rope or the reel, we have clearance there as well. We've got our fuel tank placed in between the two units and then the eight gallon a minute machine is also placed on a similar manner. We did the same thing. It came with inch and a half bolts with washers in the feet. We replaced those with three and a half inch so we could get through and have enough gripping power on the bottom. You can see this one's not quite in yet. So right here, you just line up the things. This would slide all the way through and go all the way through the wood into the bottom. And then on the bottom, we get into a mounting situation where we just bolt them down. So that's gonna be final placement. We've gotta finish some plumbing.